in this video, I will be doing a Ballora cosplay, so please stick to the end, and I hope you enjoy! Also, be sure to like and subscribe! The first thing I'm going to be doing is making a basic outline so that I have a general idea of where everything is going to be. For this, I am using some eyeliner. But uh, to make it a little darker, I'm going to be using a little bit of black face paint. Now for this bit, I made some eyes out of a little bit of fabric, and I am gluing them on with a little bit of liquid latex. So to make sure to smooth out uh, all the seams. Okay, now for this bit, uh, to make a contour on my forehead, I'm taking some tissues and I'm dipping them in some liquid latex. Uh, to give it more of a 3D effect, since I don't have any prosthetics. Now to make sure uh, they're sticking on right, I just added another layer of liquid latex to make sure they stick. So I'm going to be adding this effect, uh, same thing, but it's on the side of my face, so make sure it's in line with your eyes. And now I'm just covering it, uh, or painting it with the, some silver body paint to give it a metallic look. And yes, if y'all are all wondering, I do have a tube top on. Now I'm going to be filling in the holes with some black body paint. I'm just adding another layer of silver body paint to make it a bit darker. And now I'm going to be making the eyelids uh, since the face plates are going to be open. Now I'm just marking out the other bits of the uh, metal uh, wires. And same thing, as the top, you're going to be painting it in with silver body paint and outlining it with a little more black. And make sure that you don't get any of the liquid latex in your hair. Um, I happened to get some and it got stuck, so please do not make that same mistake. Now, for this bit, I'm going to be making the uh, same, uh, same thing as always, the little, little metal wire bits. And this is going to be attaching to the mouth area. And for the little mouth bit, you're going to be making sharp little teeth. Um, I didn't allow the face paint to dry out the way, so it looks a little muddy. So when you go ahead and do this, please make sure the face paint is dry first. 
before you uh, start. And now I'm going to go ahead and fill in all the little gaps with the black body paint. Careful around your nose too. Okay, so you're gonna take some white body paint and paint it along your neck um, for the little, well, you know, the little. Uh, for the white plates. Now you're going to use some black body paint and shade along the edges. And also I'm using it to outline for the, the neck of the endoskeleton. And I'm going to be using some silver uh, paint to uh, uh, color it in. I'm going to be using some black uh, face paint to outline the bottom uh, to make it pop a little. And outline it once again with some uh, silver. Now uh, for the chest bit, I'm going to be using uh, blue body paint. Um, for this bit, it was a little, well, let's just say it could have gotten a little better. Um, I was being a little in too impatient uh, with this, so I kind of sped through. But when you go to do this, please take your time and make sure that you do everything correctly. Now, for this, uh, for the little chest bit, uh, I took some hot glue on a piece of paper, I made little circles, and uh, to make a little pearl bit, and I just used some liquid latex to stick it on. Now I'm going to go ahead and paint in the arms. Um, once again, please make sure that you take your time and don't rush through like I did. I'm just making the little outlines on her arm with the, the black face paint. And I'm just, all I'm doing now is just adding in some highlights. Uh, now, for whenever you go to paint your ears, please don't paint it too far in to where the paint gets stuck, because that would be really bad. So, for this, I made little, uh, homemade face, pl uh, face plates out of uh, some poster board. So what I did was I marked it around my face um, and of course you would cut it out to the shape you need. Uh, I took some little mini uh, door hinges and I hot glued them onto the poster board and I took a little bit of liquid latex and stuck it on so it would have that 
so I would be able to open and close it. Um, for the bottom bits, they were a bit heavy, so I had to use a uh, spirit gun. But I hope you enjoy, and enjoy the video. Hey everyone, so I have a little guessing game for y'all. In the next video, I am going to be doing another cosplay makeup tutorial, and I am making a costume from scratch for it, and I want y'all to guess who it is. So, here is the costume so far. So, I want y'all to guess who this is in the description below. I hope y'all have fun and enjoy!